Hey y'all, it's Betsy with Happily Ever After, etc. And I am on the Carnival Horizon. So mom and I just boarded for an eight day cruise. We are going to Aruba, Bonaire, La Romana, and Amber Cove, which is all four new ports for me. Mom has been to all but one Bonaire. So this will be exciting. We are staying in the Havana area. So if you want to check out the entire Havana area, our room, the pool, I'm going to do a look at all of that, but we just boarded the ship. You can see Miami in the background. We have been on the horizon once before um, with my brother. It was his very first cruise, and so we already know we like the ship. I will still be doing a full ship tour for you, don't worry, but for today, day one, boarding the ship, there is there's not a lot of fun, exciting, super cool party people things to do. We checked into our room. We're going to get unpacked. We have your time dining right now. So we have to switch to early dining because mom prefers early dining and then a show. I do finally have my very own platinum card. So I'm very excited. Uh, this is my first platinum cruise. So we are going to go for lunch at the Pig and Anchor. So if you didn't know, they have a free buffet on um, the first day and usually sea days, which is fun because if you go for dinner, of course, it is an extra fee. And then I think mom just wants to hang out kind of down by the pool. It is very, very important Pokemon community day. So she's got important Pokemoning things to do. So come hang out with us and we're just going to show you what the first day of a cruise looks like. See if mom's out by the pool. Yep. She make any friends yet? All right, mom, did you catch all the shinies? Not a single shiny. You're just having the worst luck. Are you having fun yet? So much fun. I think we're just going to hang out here for a little while. So you can see there are lounge chairs and big clamshells, towels, We've got hot tubs and the pools and the ocean. Out of Miami on the horizon you can see the port here the rest of the ships down below it's mostly just observation deck for the crew but up above these are all Havana cabins with balconies and up top is deck 9 Lido so we are right below Lido and when everyone is gathering for the go away party up top, everyone in the Havana area can come out and watch the going away party from the pool. Woo. Falling down the stairs. So, if you have a Havana Cabana, 
not a balcony, but a cabana. You can come right out your door and walk straight down to the pool. So here are the cabanas. And you can see they're all labeled from the outside. They all have the same setup with the loungers, a little swing, a little table. Now the only thing that would be better is if there's a door at the end, because our room, <laughs> 5221, is right out midway, interior. We are in an interior Havana cabin this trip, which is very, uh, it's nice, but it is small, which, you know, we're, we're good with. You can see that it is supposed to sleep anywhere from two to four. So both of these spaces up here will drop down into bunks if you are traveling with more people. Forgot my pillow, but two beds. They can also push these together to make a king if you are traveling with a spouse or someone you want to share a bed with instead of my mama, who I do not want to share a bed with. <laughs> Nightstands, your little lamps. And then this side, we have our mini fridge. We have some shelves and our Havana towels. Now the Havana area, of course, has its own exclusive pool. So you get special towels and a wristband that allow you into that pool area. We have our vanity and our little chair, our desk area. And this always has a few USBs and a few uh, American and even a three prong plug. And we have our closet, which typically there are three bays, but there's only two in this room. There's the long one for hanging things and then the shelves and drawers with the safe, which, you know, we're on a ship. It's fine. We'll make it work. Mom loves to unpack on the ship, so I'm sure she will. Then the bathroom with our tiny shower. I've seen worse. I've seen better. And always lots of little glass shelves in here. So there you go. An entire interior Havana stateroom tour. All right, y'all, day one is over. We got settled into our room. We hung out down at the Havana pool, which you can see is empty right now. Um, pool up here, still hopping, still going strong, mainly the hot tubs. And uh, the pizza place has a line all the way across the door, but it's a good first day. First day is always a little crazy when you have to travel, so we have to drive and fly. And you know, take all the things to get here. So we always just kind of relax, hung out by the pool, got some lunch, went to dinner. We did get our dinner switched to early dining, so Mom is happy. We went to the Welcome Aboard show and the comedy club, and now we grab some pizza and we're gonna hang out and go to bed. So I will see y'all for our first port day. Um, in two days, we have two sea days, so. See what there is to do on a sea day on the horizon. Haven't been on this ship on a sea day in uh, two years? Three years since I turned 30, so. 
I will see y'all in the next video. If you want to check out um, our last cruise when we were on the Pride for a month, I will link to that playlist right here. I will see y'all in the next video.